On September 12, 2022, Manjaro released the 27 beta version of its Manjaro Fosh operating system. I installed it on my Pine phone, and I will present it to you in this video. Let's first look at the apparition of an application called Mobile Settings, which is a kind of second settings application, in which there are several sections including new features. In the lock screen section, you can for example activate the two options, upcoming events and calendar which will allow you to quickly access your events and your calendar from the lock screen. To access it, swipe right from the lock screen. First you'll have access to your scheduled events for the next 7 days, and if you swipe left you'll then have access to a very basic calendar. These features have just been added and it would be interesting to see others in the same genre soon, such as a basic notepad for example. The compositor section will allow you to correct a very common display bug on Fosh. Here is an example. There, I'm on add and remove software, Manjaro Fosh's application store, and when I click on an app, to install it, the interface becomes incomplete. Fortunately, it's now possible to fix this problem by going to the compositor section and then selecting the app that poses a problem. As you can see, the problem is solved as the application is now fully displayed, however, it's important to note that the interface is less suitable for use on mobile when this mode is activated, because the text and icons are smaller. Still in the compositor section, note that there is a function allowing you to apply what we have just seen to all the applications, nevertheless, the developers advise to use this option only as a last resort, probably because of the problems mentioned above. Otherwise, as a general rule, the operating system is always more fluid and its use increasingly easy, with particular care given to the animations and with the correction of numerous bugs. It's also important to note that you can now take photos with your PinePhone Pro, which was not possible before. This is already the end of this video. If you also want to try these new features on your PinePhone, I invite you to download the image from the link you will find in the description.